I'm a visual artist. Uh, my weapons are video and installation art. I got interested in uh, making experimental music videos and documentaries and I've combined those two things together and that's what I do. I wanted to make work about reality television. Uh, in, in the downtime of when my child was asleep and when I was breastfeeding I was sitting at home on the couch and I guess I yeah, became a, a house mum uh, watching television. <laughs> all day long <laughs> and America's Next Top Model is something that I've been watching quite a bit of and I'd watched 16 seasons of it. I thought okay well um, I see myself being you know a little bit obsessed with a show like that and you know you sort of put yourself in the position of being the judge or the model so I decided that I would transfer my face onto the faces of every winner from America's Next Top Models. If I can feel it you can, you can, you can too. I got to show in Numia at the Chibao Cultural Centre. That was my opportunity to use Numia as the site for where I'd place my images onto uh, their billboards and their bus stops, um, yeah, as the video component of that work. I guess it was me owning, owning that, you know, that I'm, I watch these things and being a new mother, you, you have this sort of like this height where you, you feel really confident and you, you know, you're overwhelmed by the experience of giving birth and then sort of like the following months you're a different person and, and you just sort of get to know the new you, the new body, the new mind and, and um, responsibilities. So I guess for that work, the top model in that sense was sort of me confronting that. I know that was a real hard challenge for me, but um, at the same time, it, at least I can own everything about myself, um, the way I look, the way I feel, um, my mindset. I think that's the, the humour in it, that maybe anyone can be a top model.